That's what it's all about right there. The GCW medallion. And the Diamond Cup. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the finals. The Killer Bay. Trying for a lockup. Gets caught by the wrist. You could see there was a different look of focus and determination from the Killer Bay, but now Killer Bay just in self-preservation mode as Jordan oh, no. Blade. Blade in full pursuit, grabs oh her God. by the hair. Oh, no, Heather Monroe. Oh, smart, oh. smart move. Right on the side of the knee, taking out the stability of Jordan Blade. Jordan, I mean, the action's getting pretty close to us over here, Sticks, but. I'm fine with it. Oh my God, right on the knee. There's an old saying about a one-legged one -legged lady in an ass-kicking contest. I don't know. Whoa! I don't know if that one-legged lady ever caught eyes with Jordan Blade. Jordan Blade with a shot right to the mush. Oh, Jordan, my God. Heavens. Did you hear that? And that's the thing about Jordan Blade is that Jordan is a straight shooter. And, oh, no. So, I guess, is Heather Monroe as sends Jordan Blade straight into the post. Breaking our officials count as well is the killer bay. Here's the thing about those posts. They're not rounded. They're square. There's corners on those posts. And it uh, looks like Heather Monroe is using the every single side of those corners to her advantage. When you catch your face on that post, it's going to hurt. And think about the, the sharp, jagged edges that are digging into Jordan Blade's leg as well. These ladies doing what they got to do. I love to see the fight in women like this. What an uppercut shot. Honestly, the amount of intensity that every competitor in this competition has shown that there has been no lack of ferocity in the Diamond Cup Tournament of 2022. Phenomenal stuff all night long. And here's the best part. It's not even over yet. It certainly is not. We still have our GCW Diamond Division Championship being defended. And speaking of which, Jordan Blade had some pretty uh, harsh words for Queen Aminata on social media. you got to imagine Jordan Blade is looking to advance and pick up this, this victory, this Diamond Cup, in order to challenge Queen Aminata. Blade gets rolled back into the ring. Heather Monroe, though, not giving Jordan Blade an, smart, an inch to work with. Move. Wrapping the hamstring around the bottom rope, using that five count. Modified knee bar using that bottom rope, and those ropes are not ropes, they're steel cables, ladies and gentlemen, that is not comfortable. You are absolutely right about that, and Jordan Blade, is, the, the leg of Jordan Blade has been going through so much agony at the hands, at the, at the post. Not just in this match, but all night long. All night long, and then think about Heather Monroe since her first bout with Sandra Moon has been going through it. Both of these competitors have been in such hellacious matchups throughout this evening. You got to imagine the gas tank is pretty low on both of these competitors. And Monroe takes Jordan Blade down. And again, the ongoing onslaught. I don't think that the submission sniper is used to being in this kind of ankle Look at the way she's wrenching the knee, the ankle. Oh, with the sleeper! Look, she got the Hang sleeper on. in! It's in! It's in deep! It's in deep! Oh, no, but Heather Monroe just wailing on the knee of Blade. Forces Blade to break that sleeper hold. What a fight! I mean, that... We have seen rear naked chokes have ended matches for Jordan Blade any kind of submissions and as we saw with me knockouts look at the tactician in the killer Blade just picking apart jordan blade very old school very smart taking her time keeping uh -oh, her air uh -oh. oh my god she picked the ankle she picked the ankle but Jordan Blade also oh picked, unfortunately, God. an opportunistic moment, but so close to the ropes, Heaven Monroe was able to break the hold. Heaven Monroe took that opportunity to, you know, get, get some adulation from the crowd here, but Jordan Blade is capitalizing. You, you gotta pay attention. Blade is deadly. But then again, so is Monroe. And that's the thing, Sticks, is that it's going to oh, come down. Oh, my God! God. Release Jordan, Whoa, Jordan, Jordan Blade. Blade back up on the road! back suplexes that was an endorphin rush if ever we it. have seen one i don't usually applaud in the middle of a match but god damn that was great 
That was phenomenal. That was absolutely incredible. And you can see the toll that it has taken on both of these competitors. All of the, the battle scars, the souvenirs, as we were saying before, from their previous matches in this competition. Think, think about this, though. Jordan Blade wins, right? You got Blade versus Aminata. Killer Bay wins. You get Killer Bay versus Aminata, too. Either way, the fans win. I mean, think about the fact that, yes, the Either Diamond way. Division Championship is on the mind, I'm sure, of these competitors, but it's any division. I mean, Blonde Force Trauma could come in and challenge for the Tag Team Championships. Could you Blonde Force Trauma versus Culture. This could happen. What? That is the power of the Generation Look Champion this. Medallion. Look at this. They're slapping the hell out of each other. Oh. Wow, Jordan Blade unstoppable. Blade hooks her up. Fisherman Suplex. With the bridge! With the bridge! <laughs> so incredibly close. So much riding on this match. So much riding on this moment for these two competitors. Ladies and gentlemen, if you are watching this right now on Title Match Network, I want you to tell your friends about Generation Championship Wrestling because this is top-notch wrestling anywhere in the country. Anywhere. It truly is, and these are top-notch competitors that are seen all over the country. Facing for the first time here at Sleeper, CCW. Sleeper, oh Sleeper, my God, no, no, no. Sleeper. Heather Monroe losing steam. Monroe's out, she's gonna pass out. She's gonna pass out, she's in the middle of the ring, she can't reach the ropes. Nowhere to go for Heather Monroe. Is this where the Killer Bay calls her quits? With the, with Jordan Blake locked in. Locked in, that's it, that's gotta be it. No, 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 Heather. Can Heather still fight? Is there anything left? Ref, you gotta check her. You gotta check her. She's turning as blue as her hair. Look at her. Nobody. Heather Monroe. Oh, Heather. Shoulders down. Shoulders. shoulders down. But Jordan Blade so quick to shift back into position. Heather Monroe, though, wants more. Uh oh, oh. No, Rose is doing cover. Look at down. this. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, forcing Jordan Blade to break the hold. Heather Monroe definitely had some wherewithal. You gotta wonder how much Monroe's got left. Monroe's caught by Blade. Blade hooks sir. No, no. Beaten down on the shoulder with those back elbows is the Killer Bay. Back to the knee, shot to the chin. Oh no, now. Looking for that beat. Bay DT oh, once my more God. from a shorter distance. Heather Monroe, can she capitalize? Is that it for Jordan Blade? No. What? Now if you're Heather Monroe, you can see the look Heather Moreau is absolutely flabbergasted. People don't kick out of the Bay DT. Well, especially a short one like that. Your face got nowhere to go but down. There's nowhere to go but catch that mat right in the face. And that mat is not comfortable. It's not a trampoline, folks. That is hard. Boards underneath. And Jordan Blade just took a face-first collision into the canvas. But still, Jordan Blade on her feet. Heather Monroe helping oh, her up no. to the top turnbuckle. Though. Oh my God. I don't like where this is going. This Sticks. is a car crash on I-4 if I've ever seen one. No, and now Jordan Blade. Oh my God. Able to fight back with some midsection shots to the Killer Bay. I'm a little nervous right now. I'm a little nervous. I think our crowd's a little nervous. Jordan Blade. Oh! Though able to create separation. God, from the second row. Face first, a face buster. Jordan. Blade in control. Jordan trying to remember her name. Oh, and knee first into the turnbuckle. Heather Monroe oh, scoops up oh, Blade. Look at her with the oh, she's on the ropes. Come on. And there she is. Here is your winner and winner of the Diamond Cup Tournament, Heather Monroe. Heather Monroe, your second annual Diamond Cup champion wins the Diamond Cup and the GCW medallion. You can call it foot on the ropes. You can call it opportunity. You can call it what you want, but I call it victory.